Hey family, this is Pastor Heber Brown III of the Pleasant Hope Baptist Church and the Black Church Food Security Network. I'm here alongside Sister Minnie Little. Sister Minnie Little has been a member of this church longer than I've been pastor of this church. She's one of the founding pillars of this church, not a founding member, but one of the pillars of this congregation. And uh, above all of that, uh, she is the servant leader of our kitchen ministry here at Pleasant Hope. She has helped to feed countless hundreds of people in her many years of leading this ministry. Sister Minnie, you know how many years? Remember how many years? About, about 20. About 20 years yeah. uh, in this or ministry or more. Yeah. Uh, and uh, as you can imagine, she's one of the most popular people uh, at this church because of her gift in the kitchen. Sister Minnie can throw down. And more than just throwing down, Sister Minnie has insight and wisdom that uh, many, especially in my generation and younger, uh, lessons that skipped over us or lessons that we missed out on, basically when it comes to preparing your food well. I gotta tell you that it was Sister Minnie Little who helped teach me the significance and the importance of seasoning your food well. Um, my family uh, struggles, many of my family struggle with um, high blood pressure, meaning that we got to stay away from the salt. It was Sister Minnie who helped to teach me that you don't have to just dump salt on everything, uh, that you can season it well. Now why am I introducing, introducing you to her, or her to you, or vice versa? Because this coming Sunday at Pleasant Hope Baptist Church, we're having our Soil to Sanctuary Market in partnership with the Black Church Food Security Network where fresh produce and meats will be available for sale from farmers from North Carolina, Virginia, and many other parts as well. And while the market is going on, Sister Minnie will be right here in this kitchen uh, helping to lead us in a workshop and food demonstration. Guess what, y'all? She is going to prepare a Cornish hen for us. We're going to have Cornish hens available for sale at the market, but I recognize that some people don't know how to make these hens. So I turned to the person who I knew could throw down on a Cornish hen. Sister Minnie, what's one of the things that, just to give them a teaser, let's not share everything, but a teaser uh, to entice them to come and be a part, what's one thing that we should keep in mind when preparing for instance a Cornish hen. Is there a particular seasoning that you like for the hen? Yes, we can use the Montreal chicken seasoning. Plus we can add some paprika and some uh, herb seasoning with garlic. And that way you prepare the chicken, you clean it, and you season the chicken and let it sit for at least 15 to 20 minutes before you try to bake it so that the seasonings can soak in. You can also season outside and inside. You can squeeze a lemon inside. That will take the place of the salt. And then you would, I, right now I use uh, the spraying butter. I use a lot of that. And that will help it to brown if you're baking it in the oven. Wait a minute, can I go back to the lemon? What did you say about the lemon? You can squeeze the lemon inside to season it and it will have a very good taste because that will take the place of salt. You don't need salt. The lemon will help replace the salt? Yes. Good Lord. All right, this is live. I ain't never even heard that before. Yes. I love lemon, but I ain't never heard about the lemon, lemon. helping to replace the yes. salt. Yes, and lemon makes butter taste better too. Also, yes. See, I, I'm getting the education live on camera, and I know you will as well. It's high time for us to better recognize and honor those in our churches, those kitchen ministry leaders, for the wisdom that they share, uh, for what they have uh, in terms of the information. Because again, for many of us, those lessons got skipped over or we missed out on them. When you come to church, and rub up against the shoulders of a sister mini, uh, you get that information that can help you for a lifetime to come. I am one of many people in this church who receive Ziploc bags of seasonings from sister mini, who's helping people to learn how to season their food properly and not be over dependent on salt 
Because, you know, for some folks, it's just salt, salt, salt. But we ain't got to do that. That's right. Right. So, come, be here. Sunday, August 5th, Pleasant Hope Baptist Church, 430 East Belvedere Avenue, Baltimore, Maryland. We'll be here from 12 to 2 for the market. And if you got some time, we'll be here at 10 a.m. We're going to have a wonderful worship experience from 10 to 12. It's going to feed your spirit. Then after that, we're going to feed your body as well. You're going to be blessed. Be here. For more information, check us out on our website, blackchurchfoodsecurity.net. God bless you. See you soon.